Dud said that you might... I was asked to give them. And I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me? Instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey. Hey. If I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah. I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Williamson, Williamson. What, Morgan? Just to say, well, even you can't screw up killing O'Driscoll's. Funny. And I guess you're good here. Unless some soft-handed feller comes along and tells you you've gone too far. What are you talking about? Starting that big bullock up in Valentine? How wise you think beating a man to death would have been? With all them folks looking on, when we supposed to be laying low. I saw your eyes, Morgan. You didn't go clever, you went soft. Uh, I'll take it. After all, you are an authority on not being clever. The captive gets a little cough in his throat, looks at you with some big doe eyes. You gonna let Comb go free? I was fighting Comb when you was pretending to fight Indians. Don't call my record into question. Now we go left, uh, Rod will take us up and round. Save your horses, we gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this game. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then, how are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law. Nature. You're out for yourself. See? This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live. Free. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boys, we're almost on them. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Amen to that. Here, here. I swear, this is where he was. Shut up. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We we go down the hill into the forest. Whoa, we're going in quiet, taking them out as we find them, trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. Settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Follow me, all right? Ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. 
I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Just over the ridge. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you, strangers? Yup. From Cuomo Driscoll? Well, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm, yes, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. I'm gonna deal with this first. Okay, go to work. Morgan, the next two. What's the plan? Let's get close to these two. Make no mistakes here. That's what the knife's for. When we're there, we move at the same time. Sooner we get this over with. You want to Moving on the camp? I left our guide up there. He's meek as a little lamb. He better be. Feather on the log. What are we doing about him? This one's mine. We need him right. Go on and show us then. Check. 
You look out here. Now, what you stashing in here? Give me some of that Irish gold. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, thank you. <sighs> Como Driscoll. He ain't here. You set us up. Come here! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Como Driscoll ain't here! He was here, I swear! I, sw I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't <laughs> have saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. Get lost. Get lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> yeah, right you are. At least you got something tucked away. Damn! Come on! What's the hold up? Play your damn hello. Mr. Morgan! I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither, but seeing I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. How's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down, then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both, we're being gentlemen about this. 